All right, so here, here I am in Roslyn on the east side of the Cascades. It's raining really hard and cold on the west side. And it's windy and cold here. It's like low 40s. Snowing up in the mountains. You know, maybe 7,000 feet up. But it's cold. It's not June. Okay, we are a couple minutes into the climb. It's nice to have the sun out. Or I consider this sun. It's not raining. All right, here we are. This is Paul's trail in Roslyn. Oh man, I just about lost it on that corner. I get this cornering down a little bit better. It's all about cornering. I'm gonna take you on uh, a real good downhill today on uh, Rat Pack, which is really, really cool. Here we are on uh, Rat Pack. I don't. So this is a trail that you have never seen uh, before. This is a, a double, like a double black diamond, I think. And this is not the double black diamond area. This is the. I think it's just black. It gets it gets harder. Okay, here we are in Rat Pack. This is this is double black. It's supposed to be. It's a lot of just tricks. And I think it's got big jumps too. Really tight corners like that just screw you up. Oh man, got wider handlebars and I'm not used to how wide they are just about hit those damn trees goes up and down like that quite a bit I have to get real good at cornering on this thing or I'm gonna get toast We got another. I remember it gets hard though near the end, about three quarters of the way through. It's hard on, uh, oh, you'll see, it's just hard. Certain things. I hit a big jump back there, which was really freaking cool. Ah, doing good on my cornering. Oh, this ought to be interesting. This is why it's so hard. You don't want to fly over your handlebars going down just like that. You can really do some damage there if you're not aware of what's going on. It's all good. Got some people behind me too. We'll see if they catch up. They're on dirt bikes. They should. All right, we're about halfway done with this trail, and it should be whole oh, black to the left. That's where I'm going. Oh, I think this is the. Oh yeah, I don't know about this. Oh yeah, I'm not doing that shit. I did that when I was younger. Yeah, this is freaking crazy. These trails are. They're just up and down like that. Freaking fun though. I mean, 
It used to be my other bike, it wasn't fun. But this bike handles this really well. I gotta get that front brake all changed out. Somebody spent a lot of time making these freaking trails. Well, dang, I just about bit it. Handlebars, I'm not used to them. A little bit wider. Boy, that those dirt bikes that were behind me are suck if they're not passing me. Because there's no no way that I'm cleaning up a dirt dirt bike. There's just no way. Whoops. I didn't mean to take that, but that was freaking cool. doing Lynn uh, of course Lynn's not talking she's like what are you doing Terry don't be going this fast there's a ledge to the right yeah there is I'm freaking kicking ass on this though this is how you get hurt though I hate to say it because I got some speed coming in here and I'm just bombing down this shit. Notice I didn't take that jump. I I was not gonna launch off that. That that would have been nuts. Oh. Well, this trail is so I don't have any time to turn the camera off or on. It's kind of crazy. Oh man I just about missed that corner. Oh, man. Dang it, I didn't do that corner well. Son of a gun. got that corner huh oh man that was insane oh and then put a jump on it Reckon A Tell you how hard this is just it's just almost like well it's not straight down but it's just you can't control the speed you're just trying to hang on oh i don't know about that jump that oh don't take it terry i could have taken that it's just a little bit steeper than i wanted to So this is what downhill is, guys. This is why I don't care for it too much. I mean, it's all right, but you can get hurt pretty quick. All right, so I'm done with Rat Pack, and now I'm climbing the uphill trail again, E-Walk. I'm about maybe three quarters away up it. It's nice to have my legs, my legs warmed up and ready to go, which is cool. So um, my goal here is I'm going to be 
I would love to do this as a downhill because it's just a lot of fun, but I may do Brass Monkey. It's just more, a little more challenging. We'll see when I get up. Okay, here we go on Brass Monkey. It should be Brass Balls. This thing's a hard frickin' uh, horse. Woo! Yeah, baby! We'll see how I do on this. I remember the corner good. So far, so good. Oh, yeah! It's like a freaking slow. Oh, man. Geez, so tired. Fucking A. Oh, it's not good. Oh, that's awful. I gotta be careful because if I'm that tired, I'm gonna have a hard time. Once you start getting tired, you're pretty much screwed. I smell some jumps. How do I smell the jumps? No, I don't know, but let's hope. Gotta be something coming up. It's open. Dang, I was going too slow around that. Oh, it's gotta be a jump somewhere. Oh, it's gotta be a jump. I gotta be careful what I'm wishing for. Ah, oh, a little bit. Oh, here we go. Oh, I'm not getting that gap. That's where I'm suck at. Take a break here. Oh, jeez, have I lost it? Saw a good rider. He was just right next to me just because he did a really good job. He took that gap jump, which is pretty aggressive. One day I'm gonna get that. Certainly getting better at doing this uh, downhill stuff. You know, I'm, I'm taking these corners a lot better. Still sliding a little too much, but I've got to position my feet a little bit different. And I'm leaning my bike more, which is good. That's a heck of a jump there. One day. Oh man, I didn't even see that darn thing. 
sometimes you come up on those jumps and it's just like you have you know it's just like all of a sudden they're there it's like you got to take them hanging on with that one. I was hanging on too. Oh, I just about lost that one. Thank God for my front fork. I thought, son of a gun. Wow. I think I got all my suspension on that son of a gun. I got a cross country bike and it handles it, but. Man, that. <laughs> 